Hello and welcome to Pickles Garage. Today we're going to be doing some marriage counseling by reconnecting our rear defogger to this fine piece of glass right here. These do pop off. I honestly don't really even use my rear hatch, but just the heat and whatnot, they eventually come off, but easy enough repair. So what you can do is you can get these rear defogger Permatex. They come, you can get them at Amazon or you can get them at your local AutoZone. They do have the larger packs that is like a full repair kit and that repairs these lines and whatnot, but I really just have the need to reconnect this. So we're gonna go ahead and dive right into it. Really, you only need this pack and a pair of scissors. Okay, step one is to one, make sure your defogger is off but we're going to remove this tab here. And so there is this little push button right here on the back, you'll press that in. And while you're doing that, you will pull this out. So it might resist a little bit, but as long as you're pushing in this, you just have to give it a good yank. So we're gonna leave this disconnected throughout the course of this process, as well as 24 hours afterwards. So leave that one alone. Uh, this you're going to visually inspect, make sure that it is still a flat surface, there's no debris or barbs or anything. You can kind of give it a, a sample test here, make sure it's going to sit flat. And if it's not, then you can use a little gentle piece of sandpaper just to remove any kind of barbs or whatever because it does need to make a full, flat, clean surface. So you don't want to remove too much of what is on either surface, certainly not this one, but if you need to smooth it out, you absolutely can do that. So we're gonna go ahead and make sure that lines up, which it did. And then the next step is going to be to actually use the towelette and clean the surface. Okay, so the towelette, now you'll notice it does say danger on it, and in the instructions they're very specific about not touching the towelette, all right? Don't touch it. So at first I thought it was gonna be more related to the fact that you don't wanna damage whatever is on it or defeat the purpose of cleaning, but it's got danger on it, so I'll be a little extra cautious. Basically, we're just gonna open this up to expose this towelette here. Kind of peel it back a little bit. And then we are cleaning both the tab itself as well as the surface on the glass. So I'm gonna do one on this side, get it nice and clean. And I'm gonna set it aside and careful not to touch it. And then I'm also going to rub this on the surface of the glass real quick. Okay, so as mentioned, rubbing it on the surface of the glass, careful not to touch it. Cool. Now you are going to let that sit for five minutes, it says. So we will let that sit for five minutes and let that sit for five minutes. And while we're waiting our five minutes, we can knead our adhesive here. So basically it's got two separated components that we are now combining. And it says that it needs to be one uniform beige color. If it is not a uniform beige color, then it will not work effectively. So I got beige pretty quick, but Seeing as I have time to kill, might as well make sure it's extra needed. But it's gonna look kind of like that. So I'm gonna ride out these next four and a half minutes, and then I will show you the final step, making sure we don't touch any of our freshly cleaned electronic components. Stand by. All right, so now that we've given it all it needs, we are going to apply it to the tab here. Um, I don't really think I actually needed scissors, so I'm gonna skip that component here. So we're gonna go ahead and 
put one little drop of the lot in the center like that and then we are going to immediately attach it to the glass and hold it there for one minute. All right, so once your one minute is up, it will look like so. You just gotta line it up with exactly where it was. And as mentioned earlier in the video, you're gonna wait 24 hours before you reconnect this little thing. Just slides right back on like that and you are good to go. Thank you very much for watching and uh, hopefully you have a great rest of your day. All right, bye.